Hello all. In this video, we are going to discuss about the Open HRMS announcement module. So as we know that Open HRMS is an open source HR management solutions that provide you an entire solution for managing the HR within your organization. And obviously it works well for both the small as well as the large scale enterprises. And obviously the open HRMS modules are self-sufficient in managing as well as solving each and every major problems that you face while dealing your HRs. So in this video, we will discuss about the open HRMS announcement module. So by default, the ODO does not have the provisions for managing the announcements and all. So with this, we have brought up a module called as announcement module. So once you install the announcement from the app store, you will receive the module like this over here. So this is the announcement module. So basically the open HR must announcement module is used to make the announcement activities or to mention the upcoming celebrations of days and other special events too. So to make a such kind of announcements, we are using this module. So here you can see we have the options to create the announcements. So here you will get the options to create the new announcement. So here itself, you have an option whether to mention whether it is a general announcement or not. So if it is a general announcement, you can just enable this option called as the general announcement. Otherwise, you can just disable that. And here you can provide the necessary title for your uh, announcement. So suppose if I provide here, you can provide the title like seminar and all and here you can mention the start date as well as the end date also then here you have the option to see the uh, announcement type so for announcement types we have the four three different sets that is by employee by department or by job position so for a particular employee also what we can do is that we can make an announcement so when you select that announcement type as by employee here automatically you will get an option to add your employee and similarly by department also. So when you do that, you will have the option to mention the department and also by job position. So this means that with this announcement module, we have the wide varieties of options to make the announcements by employee wise also department wise and as well as for the job position. So this is the thing that we are dealing with this announcement. So if you want to provide a particular seminar section that should be attended to a particular employee itself, then you have the options to make an announcement type as that by employee or if it is general you can just mark it as general announcement so this is something that we can say we can have this module for making the announcement and similarly if you have any kind of attachment you can make this attachment over here and you can also add certain other details when you come down here you can also mention certain other details regarding the announcement itself so this is about the announcement module and obviously what happens is that after you once you create your announcements you can just ask or you can send it for approval so currently i have logged in as michelle admin so right now you can click on the option called as send for approval automatically it will show that is moved to the stage called as waiting for approval so right now since i have logged in as my administrator itself that's why it is showing the two buttons of approve as well as refuse so these are the options so once it is approved the announcement or this kind of announcement the general announcement that we have created will move into the state called as approved state so this is the basic functionality of the announcement module that is we are using here in the open hms so likewise you can create all your announcements and all and one of the other thing that you can also see is that in the dashboard also you would be able to see the announcement so we have discussed about the dashboard module so to know more about the dashboard module please check the link below so in the dashboard module itself when you come down you can see the announcement also so from the dashboard also it is able to view the announcements that is being created also so this is all about the open hrms announcement module with which it help us to make the announcement activities about certain upcoming celebrations special events and so on so thank you for watching this video
If you are interested in knowing more about this or looking for any Odoo implementation or customization in your business, just drop your request to odoo at cybrosis.com.